going that way. <laughs> this past September, uh, American commemorated the 10th anniversary of the 9-11 terrorist attacks. The media was filled with where are they now stories, reflections on how the attacks changed America. But one aspect of that fateful September day was overlooked. Are you guys familiar with Clear Channel? Clear Channel owns one-third of all the radio stations in this country. They used to own seven stations in Slow County alone. And uh, they own the Rush Limbaugh show. So you ever wonder why Rush Limbaugh is the only radio show in America? Because the same company that owns Rush Limbaugh owns all the radio stations. <laughs> Isn't that ironic? Yeah. And uh, Tom Hicks, the billionaire head of Clear Channel, donated millions to George W. Bush's presidential campaign. He also served with Bush on several corporate boards, as well as buying the Texas Rangers from George Bush, giving Bush a 2,400% profit, by the way. Yeah. And remember those Dixie Chicks protests a while back? Every single one of them was sponsored by a Clear Channel station. And to this day, several of the local country stations will not play the Dixie Chicks because they used to be owned by Clear Channel. This is the corporate mentality that created this list. In response to the 9-11 attacks, a mid-level executive assembled a list of 300 songs that might be deemed uncomfortable for Clear Channel's audience to hear and were no longer to be played. The command was later changed to only play after great thought. <laughs> <laughs> you better play, think real hard again, buddy, before you play that one, you know? Thinking of playing that? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, the list was almost immediately rescinded, but copies got out. And you can understand how some of these songs got on here. Because like the Dave Matthews band, Crash Into Me, Sugar Ray Fly, <laughs> Van Halen Jump. They're just crappy songs. They shouldn't be heard. <laughs> the Tramps Disco Inferno. Cool. The Night Chicago Died. Yeah. Wait a minute. In the air tonight, Phil Collins. All right. Yeah, we don't need to hear that anymore. <laughs> but any song referencing heaven, death, airplanes, fire, New York, anything that could be remotely construed as reminding people of that awful event, gone like a puff of smoke. Johnny Angel. I'm burning, I'm burning for you. Dirty deep. Done dirt cheap. <laughs> knock, knock, knocking on heaven's door. Not anymore. <laughs> Big old jet airliner. Then there's the whole set with Mid Eastern ties that they didn't want you to hear, like walk like an Egyptian. <laughs> Rock the Casbah. Rock the <laughs> Not anymore. Uh, Obladia Lada. <laughs> Down, chop suey. Man, do Americans suck at geography. <laughs> and you know that the people compiling this list, once word got around the office, people were peeking their heads in the door, making suggestions, you know? <laughs> I'm in pieces, bits and pieces. Who thinks I'm alone when they hear that song? <laughs> now you guys do. <laughs> Leave it. On a jet plane, <laughs> don't know that I'll hit Tower One. He's <laughs> 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 my brother. Uh, some of these are just plain stupid. If we could play Buddy Holly's That'll Be the Day When He Died, who's going to be offended? Seriously. It's a sign of the times. <laughs> oh, when the shark bites. <laughs> I feel the earth move. Under my feet. 99 loft balloons? <laughs> the most chilling part? All songs by Rage Against the Machine. You know, when you have an agenda, might as well write it. They missed a couple. It's raining men. <laughs> ignored like always. Catch me now, I'm falling. <laughs> the saddest part of all this is that Clear Channel included what turned out to be some of the most healing anthems played after 9-11. Cat Stevens, Peace Train. Louis Armstrong, What a Wonderful World. Frank Sinatra, New York, New York. John Lennon, Imagine. 
And I weave this tale of woe to just demonstrate what happens when five or six companies own 90% of everything you read, watch, listen to, and have access to for information. So you never know really what you're missing out unless you really pay attention. Thank you.